This is Joe. This is Joe's Hungry Channel. I'm at the Chick-fil-A in Cartersville, Georgia, and today I'm going to check out the Chick-fil-A Tortilla Chicken Soup. Can I get two one-cup chicken tortilla soups? That's it. It's going to be $10.69 cash. Oh, yeah. Right, and you'll pay the cash box, and you are behind the blue stand in front of you. Got it. Thanks. I've got my chicken tortilla soup. Let's pull off to the side and do the Joe is Hungry temperature test. This thing comes in at 163.4 degrees Fahrenheit. It's definitely kept up to temperature. Chick-fil-A chicken tortilla soup consists of shredded chicken breast with navy and black beans in a white creamy soup base with a blend of vegetables and spicy heat topped off with a seasoned corn tortilla strip. Each one of these comes in two sizes. They come in a cup and a bowl, the cup being the smallest. It will set you back $4.15 and the bowl will set you back $6.49 before taxes. That being said, now it's time to head back to the studios and do the Joe is Hungry weight test. All right, now it's time to complete the Joe is Hungry weight test. Uh, to start off with, the cup, that's the portion that we got when we picked him up through the drive-thru. According to uh, Chick-fil-A's own website, that should weigh 252 grams or 8.88 ounces. Uh, they also have the larger size, it's called the bowl, and uh, it's supposed to weigh 533 grams or 18.8 ounces. I didn't get the larger portion today, mainly because I don't feel like eating that much food, but I also got, as usual, two portions so I can check for consistency from soup bowl to soup bowl. And furthermore, I have taken off for the packaging weight. In other words, I've already set the tear. So let's go ahead and get started. Tortilla soup number one weighs in at 7.15 ounces. Tortilla soup number two weighs in at 7.35 ounces. That's significantly short than their posted serving weight on their own website. Chick-fil-A, you need to do a little bit better than that and fill these cups all the way. So you get a point off just for that. That being said, now it's time for the Joe is Hungry Big Reveal. This is what it looks like, and this is what it's supposed to look like. This is what it looks like, and this is what it's supposed to look like. I realized the only photos I could get were in a glass bowl, but I think you may get the picture. That being said, we saw how much it was. We saw how short-weighted it was. Now it's time for the ultimate test. It is the Joe is Hungry bite test. So it is bite test engage. Too bad uh, the seasoned tortilla chips that I forgot to put on in the beginning actually added to it a little bit they're very salty and I can taste them but it doesn't actually make the dish totally complete some of y'all like spicy food out there uh, I'm not really sure that it adds anything to the flavor but at least it's not so hot I can't eat it the black beans are nice there's corn in there that gives it flavor I'm a little bit upset that uh, Chick-fil-A is short waiting us on that. I'm kind of surprised being how it came from Cartersville where they seem to do a little bit better in respects to uh, portion size and weight. 
as far as the value for uh, four dollars and fifteen cents I think that's a little pricey for this small portion of food I'm pretty sure that they're making a tight a little profit on this nothing wrong with that but it's probably not gonna be out of my pocket so it's time to give this thing a score you can see my score on the screen and in the description below, I score one to 10, nine being the best. Anything above nine is a once in a lifetime experience and pretty much nothing makes it to 10. I'm gonna have to go with a five nine on this one. That's my review, that's my opinion. If you found this useful, if you found this interesting, subscribe to the channel, support the channel. Thumbs up, thumbs down, doesn't matter. Leave a comment, and we will see you in the next video.